straight off the back, we've been able to find one of the link pins of the KWH team, Billy Brooks, uh, also known as the assistant feed manager. Bill, tell us a little bit about your role here at Kitchen and uh, how's the yielding prep going? Yeah, it's going all right. And uh, mate, uh, how's it all going? Head down to Easter on Monday, horses all going well? Yep, they're going good. And what's your favourite one so far, mate? French Pin, Ritten Tycoon. Why, is that what you like about him? No, he's big, and I like big horses. What's your role here at the farm, mate? A lot of people sort of don't really know, but what do you get up to on a day-to-day -day process? I handle all the horses no one else can touch. Man about town and uh, always getting in the driver's seat, as you can see. And uh, Larry, you're about to embark on a feed run with Billy. Uh, what's it like? Plenty of gate opening, plenty of feeding, not much driving? Yeah, that's pretty much it, I guess. Did they tell you, <laughs> they tell you when you came to Australia you'd be uh, living the high life with Billy? No, but I'm really excited about it and so much fun. Tell us a little bit about your role as an equine waste reallocation officer here at Kitchman Hills for Yelling Barn. Well, a lot of picking boxes, preparing feeds. Yeah. Any favourite horses? Um, yeah, I guess Precious Sophia. Just because I love her, she's a sweetheart. <laughs> Getting down to the sales on Monday, what are you most looking forward to? Just for the experience, because it's going to be my first day. Just for the experience. <laughs> Alright, good luck on the feed run. <laughs> Thank you. Well, as per usual, we find ourselves uh, Ian on the lead and Lana doing the work. Ian, uh, what's your role here, mate? Just holding uh, the horse to get washed, as Lana's watching, mate. Are you, uh, you're the assistant uh, exercise coordinator here at Kitchen, mate. Are you enjoying it so far? So far, so good, mate. Who have we got here, mate? We have... Barangaroo. Barangaroo having a wash. Lana, uh, you're riding the horse as uh, chief horse washer? Yes, yeah, that's right. How's it going? Yeah, it's going good. Just got to get the horses ready for the day. Yeah. Yeah, it's going good. Yeah, it's going good. That's it. Uh, any favourites going to the barn? Well, uh, oh, definitely the Misma Philly. She's funner. Misma Philly. Uh, what are we most looking forward to about going down to Easter, guys? Oh, just the excitement. Exactly. We're still in some horses, James. Andreas, how are you, buddy? <laughs> Near to Kitchen, uh, how are you finding it, mate? <laughs> what? what? How are you going with it? <laughs> what are you up to? <laughs> Feeding. <laughs> what, else do you do? what else do you do? Just feed? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Talk to me, Andreas. Talk to I me. Talk to me. We've managed to work our way through most of the yielding crew here this afternoon, but uh, one bloke's just MIA. <laughs> here he is. H, H, I know they've just got Guinness on tap down at the Linger, mate, but come on, work time. <laughs> yeah. yeah, thanks, James, and thanks to the guys at the Linger Longer for that, actually. It's been provided a bit of sport this week. Mate, uh, how's it going at Kitchen? Easter prep, all good? Yeah, loving it. Almost finished now. Exciting draft, so it's great stuff. All heading up on Monday. Favourite horse? November flight. Thing you're most looking forward to about getting down to Easter? Ah, I haven't seen the complex before, it'll be exciting, um, really exciting draft so overall I think we're all quite excited to see how them go. With Good. a few uh, full sisters and full brothers, the horses that sold well last year, so it'll be exciting to see them as well. Alright mate, get back in there quick. Lilo, we know you're a bit camera shy, but come on, give us something to work with here. <laughs> Just piss off! <laughs> oh, g'day James! Oh yeah! Oh, what's going on? <laughs> What are you doing? Uh, so we're off to Easter uh, this coming Monday, James. Are we? When? This Monday? <laughs> this Monday. Yeah. Really? Oh, oh bloody. Okay. Bloody hell. Oh, hasn't it? It's been some prep, hasn't it, James? It has, yeah. I've spent a lot of time up here in the barn on the rake, and uh, I think the prep's really gone forward off the back of that. I think so, yeah. And uh, really looking forward to getting down to Easter. Perfect. Who are you, who are you most excited for equine-wise? Equine-wise? Uh, probably the November flight Rubik Colt. Mm -hmm. um, and yeah, I've got a little soft spot for Barangaroo more than ready, mainly because of bangers. She's oh, bangers. Oh, she is. Old mash we call the, yeah. the yearling, don't we? Yeah. Yeah, we, <laughs> we do. <laughs> you what must have, you must have missed out of, on that. What's the next line of questioning? Uh, uh, Favourite place to eat in Liverpool? Liverpool, uh, probably the Iron <laughs> Chef. Oh. Um, it's a, yeah, it's a really nice place. Um, not a lot of options down there, is there? Not a lot. Um, that dodgy looking Chinese above the... I don't want to be the dodgy Chinese <laughs> from time to time either. So, uh, look, we'll get down there and uh, we'll, we'll taste a bit of the local cuisine. But uh, yeah, Iron Chef, highly rated. And uh, looking forward to it. Bring on Liverpool. Bring on Liverpool. <laughs> I guess we've uh, <laughs> gone around the rest of the barn now, uh, all your workmates, so interesting crowd. Yeah, a bit of a motley crew there, James. Aren't they? They're heading to Easter <laughs> on Monday. Uh, no doubt there'll be a few moves on the dance floor, but down to business. Uh, <laughs> how's the prep come along? 
Yeah, really well. In fairness, they're a great group of horses that have pretty much prepped themselves. They've just been cruising. Um, That's lucky because this is your first prep as yearly manager, so lucky they've done it themselves. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> a great team as well, so made it very easy. How have you found it uh, being top dog in the yearling barn? Uh, I don't know. It was a bit of a sink or swim thing. I've hopefully Michael Phelps did. I don't know. <laughs> it's gone all right, I think. <laughs> and, uh, how have you gone with Malone? Not too much pressure on? Uh, I don't know. Lucky I think you, 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 yeah. <laughs> Had a few days rest spot before he came back. But uh, now looking forward to getting down to, to Inglis on uh, Monday. What's a couple of favourites of the draft? Uh, I've always loved the Steps and Time, the Daglia Dura filly. Um, ever since she was born, she's just been stand out for me. And old Go Indigo's got a bit of sentimental value there as well. So. Yeah, no doubt. You're going to cry again if you make one point. <laughs> no, I might hold the tears in this year, I think. <laughs> Well, uh, well done, Jess. You've done an awesome job with your first prep and uh, look forward to getting down there. Cheers, James.